As governor, you've been quite popular in your state. So why not enter the 2020 Senate race against Senator Gardner and attempt to flip the Senate blue and get rid of Mitch McConnell's monopoly on policymaking? All right, a fair question. Um, you're not the first person to ask me that question. Uh, partly in life, you've got to do the things that, or at least you're going to be more successful uh, doing things you're that you're naturally inclined towards. What I love most is putting teams together, uh, you know, getting the best people, whether it's Republic after the election's over, whether it's Republicans or Democrats, whether they're from a business background or nonprofits or from an academic background, putting these remarkably diverse teams together and doing the big progressive progressive things that, that Washington hasn't been able to do. And I think to a certain extent as a candidate, I'm the one person who's actually done what pretty much everyone else is talking about doing. That makes me feel that I should continue this effort to become the, the Democratic nomination, to win the Democratic nomination for president. Uh, because I think when you think about who is gonna be able to beat Donald Trump in Ohio and, and North Carolina, I think if by many eva many evaluations, it's, it's more likely me. We have several great Democrats in Colorado that I think we're gonna be able to beat Cory Gardner like a drum. Cory Gardner has sided relentlessly with President Trump. President Trump is unpopular in, in Colorado. I don't think they need me uh, to beat, beat him, uh, to beat Cory Gardner. And I hope, I, I believe that I will do a better job of, of beating Donald Trump than the other candidates. Now, you know, obviously not everyone, at 1% of the polls, I can't be too confident I'm gonna get the nomination. <laughs> But I do want to make sure that I give it my best effort, right? I, I don't think a lot of people are paying attention right now to the to the campaigns, and I just want to make my, sure my message is out there. And if people decide that I'm, you know, not the right person to beat Donald Trump, I accept that.